quality of life assessment in kidney care. In this video, we'll define quality of life, explain why it's important for kidney care teams to assess quality of life, discuss who, how, and when to complete quality of life assessment tools, and detail what to do with quality of life assessment tools. Quality of life is defined as an individual's perspective about their life, physical, mental, and social health, and healthcare experiences. It's what matters most to that person. But how do we discover what matters most for a person living with kidney disease? To help assess quality of life, we use tools that ask people living with kidney disease or other health conditions to answer questions about what matters most to them. How am I doing? How is my care? What matters to me? These tools are often referred to as PROMS, that is, patient-reported outcome measures. For people living with kidney disease, these tools ask questions that help them think about their whole life and not just their kidneys. What's more, it helps everyone involved to focus on what matters most to that individual. Assessing quality of life is important for many reasons. It can, one, enhance and transform care, two, provide valuable data, three, facilitate and enrich communication, and four, result in broader insights. One reason to use a quality of life assessment tool is to enhance care. Research has shown that assessments can help patients feel heard. That, in itself, improves patient care. Furthermore, used in conjunction with your clinical assessment and other health measures such as lab values, weight, vital signs, and dialysis prescriptions, quality of life assessments can inform better care decisions. Quality of life assessments not only shine a light on the patient's perspective, but also empower individuals to become active members of their own care. The whole team can focus on what matters most to the individual. This helps transform care so that it centers on the person and what matters most to that person. Besides enhancing and transforming care, Quality of life assessment tools provide valuable data that help kidney care teams look at the whole person. People have diverse and unique health needs. Even if individuals have the same medical condition, such as kidney disease, optimal care for one person may be less than ideal for another. This diversity demands different approaches to care for different people. Even when some parts of the quality of life assessment do not appear to be directly related to kidney care, these aspects are still important to assess when a person identifies that it matters most to them. When used in a multidisciplinary kidney setting, quality of life assessments also facilitate communication among everyone on the person's kidney care team. Nurses, dietitians, social workers, physicians, caregivers, and the person living with kidney disease. That's because important assessment data can be shared between all team members. Furthermore, from a larger perspective, quality of life assessment data can result in broader insights. For example, electronic data from individuals' assessments can be pooled to create large health information databases. These data can then be used to inform health decisions and policymaking further improving care. Now that we've reviewed why quality of life assessments are important, you may be wondering who completes the assessment tool. It's important for patients to answer questions about quality of life without the input of other members of the kidney care team. This encourages authentic responses, especially when it comes to the aspects of well-being that might be hard to discuss. However, Keep in mind that some people may need more support in completing the assessment tool. This may be true, for example, if the person has poor eyesight or if a language barrier exists. Quality of life assessment tools can be completed in person, on the phone, on paper, or electronically. Ideally, they are completed before appointments or dialysis treatments. To begin, you might invite the person by saying, I'd like to learn more about what matters to you and please answer these questions. Afterwards, we'll talk about them together. No one team member is responsible for quality of life assessments. It is a team effort. Once the team has collected the quality of life assessment information, 
The next steps to take are to 1. Review it. 2. Talk with the individual about their responses and really listen. And 3. Follow up as appropriate. First and foremost, look at a person's quality of life assessment information. People want to know that their kidney care team has looked at their responses. Additionally, discuss the responses with the person and really listen. This has several benefits. First, research shows that patients appreciate the discussion and they want to be heard. By simply listening, you're providing individualized care. What's more, you will learn about each individual's unique perspective. As a result of the discussion, your clinical judgment will guide your next steps. For example, you may decide to refer a person to another clinician, or you may ask a person to share the responses with another member of the healthcare team. Quality of life assessments may highlight a lot of individual concerns, especially when the person has a chronic condition, such as kidney disease. As a clinician, these concerns may feel overwhelming to address. It's important for you to know that you don't have to have all the answers. What's more, patients don't expect you to fix all their problems. They want you to hear them. Ask questions such as, from your responses, what is your number one priority today? Or, do you see this as a problem? Then listen and acknowledge what the person is saying. Overall, quality of life assessment and dialogue with the patients can enhance care. In this video, we defined quality of life, explained why it's important for kidney care teams to assess quality of life, discussed who, how, and when to complete quality of life assessment tools, and detailed what to do with quality of life assessment tools. What matters most to patients? Assessing quality of life in kidney care. Learn more at healthyqol.com.